guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Contessa Mary and today I am going to cook with our Salad Master Kitchen with a very very delicious tenderloin in vegetable puree with wine sauce. Today I am going to show you how to cook the tenderloin, okay? So our ingredients for today is, of course, we have our tenderloin here, okay? Then, for our vegetable puree mix, we have here our cauliflower, cabbage, and carrots, okay? And of course, guys, I have here also a mixed vegetables, frozen, okay? Later on, I will going to show you how to cook these kind of vegetables without using water. Without using water, guys, okay? And for our sauce, very important, we have our wine you love wine guys me i love very much the wine so we have to taste first if this is good because if not we're going to throw this away okay so you must taste first your wine so i will yummy okay guys this wine is vino da tabula rosa it's very simple it came from azienda agricola zolo giovanni Shout out to this uh, winemaker. And then we have for our sauce wine, and then we have butter, flour, we're going to use later. And if you love black pepper, I also use black pepper. And I have some of rosemary. But it's optional. If you don't like rosemary, you don't have to use that. Because I love the scent of the mint, so I also put a mint on my wine sauce. Guys, let us start with our vegetables, okay? Vegetables, it's, uh, it takes 15 minutes to 20 minutes to cook, okay? So in our skillet, we are going to put all the vegetables, okay? So, so today guys, I am going to use a number 5 cone. So the higher the number, the thicker the cut, okay? So guys, I am going to cut this carrot just like this. It's very easy. So in one second, you can cut two carrots. And if you are not really uh, expert in using this machine, you can cut like that. Put in the carrot inside and then cut. Okay? So we have another two carrots. I am going to, to put five carrots, guys. This carrots is a very, very healthy. It's very good to our health. It's, uh, it's rich of beta carotene and some more vitamins and minerals. If you cook it uh, correctly, because carrot guys is very very sensitive to calories. That's why we have to cook this in a very low heat and without using water. So later I will going to show you how to cook without using water, guys. So okay. So we are cooking live, guys. That's why uh, if you see something not very perfect, please. Okay guys, the cauliflower, the very important in this cauliflower is the, this hard thing is in the center. You know why? You, we don't have to throw this away. You know why? Because all the vitamins and minerals are just concentrated in this side. But what we're going to do this more often in our house, we remove this and throw it away. So today I'm going to show you how to cook this with this very important because if we cook only this and we throw this we also throw away the goodness in our cauliflower so everything even if hard you have to cook it okay and of course in a very low heat okay so it's very easy like that guys just cut Cat and cat and cat. Okay. 
Okay, where is our cauliflower? So let's put it here. Uh -huh. Let us check the temperature of that. So I put it at a very, very low heat, number one. But now I'm going to put number two. But now in this skillet, I am going to put my tenderloin. So I already preheated this, guys. So let us check if it's already hot. So in order to know if this is ready, we just sprinkle water on top. And you see, it's dancing. So meaning, it's already ready. Okay, and now it's time to cook our tenderloin. Okay guys, with my gloves on, I am going to open this cat. Don't cut anybody, yeah? guys. Just cut this um, something and then look at this it's a very nice tenderloin and let's put it in our pan i'm not using any oil guys huh? because i am cooking in a very healthy way so i am going to show you how to eat healthy every day gaining the vitamins and minerals in our vegetables okay so the other one because Another tenderloin, and let's put it here. Vegetable is very, very uh, sensitive to calories. So if you cook or you boil your uh, vegetables, what happens? It will. If you want a tenderloin, rare or medium. You have to touch that. If it feels soft, you can uh, you can analyze your tenderloin if it's already half cooked to the other side. Okay, so just like that, it's a uh, very very smooth, meaning you have a medium rare tenderloin. Okay, guys. So it's time to flip our tenderloin because as you can see, okay. So it's grilled tenderloin guys, so I did not use any oil of this, okay, no oil, grilled, so in uh, 5 minutes, we're going to remove our tenderloin and we're going to, to cook our toast, and for the meanwhile, we're waiting for our vegetables to cook guys, so at this moment, I just wanted to if I can still smell the, the alcohol. So it's evaporating already, guys. So, and let it sit aside. Okay. So let us wait for our tender line. So, so guys, if you are going to, to stay very healthy, you have to cook this way. No using oil. Okay. So for the meanwhile that we are waiting for our vegetable to cool, I am going to show you how to use my how to make my my sauce, okay? Our wine sauce. So I have with me guys this whisker and another pan. So what we're going to do now is we have to put the uh, butter and I need some. Okay, let's use this. Small amount of butter. Okay, so we're not going to do that. And then going to put one. Two tablespoons of flour. Okay, guys, as you can see, I did not melt all the butter because I don't want that butter will will uh, going to very high heat like that. 
because you know butter is very also very sensitive to colors when it has very high temperature the what you call that some okay guys important huh? important reminders your fats and oil you have to consume that raw because if you will cook your uh, fats and oil it release some toxin when you bring it to the high heat so as you can see guys look at that look at that okay and what we're going to do now is when you're at home you can do this okay for not uh, using another utensils because when you wash it oh my god so i just do that because our salad master versatile so it's like just uh, making some uh, bechamel but instead of using uh, using milk optional you can use wine just to give a twist to our vegetable and okay and now guys let's go to check our vegetables when you hear that vapor bulb clicking meaning already reached the 86 degrees okay so let us check if our vegetables is already cooked after 15 minutes. Ta da! So well, it is zero. So what we're going to do now is we have to mix this. So I am going to show you guys if our skillet is. cooking in salad master you can maintain or retain the 93% up to 98% of vitamins and minerals in our vegetables because we are not using water and we are not using high heat okay because high heat will kill the vitamins in our vegetables okay guys so what we are going to do now guys is we have to smash this and I have a mixer. This is um, what you call this mixer in Italian. So we're going to smash it. Like that. We're going to eat the vitamins and minerals in our vegetables. We are going to cook this way, okay? And of course, we have to use our salad master skillet because the only cookware in the world that can retain 93 to 90 percent of our vitamins and minerals in our vegetables guys okay and just put like that okay voila